I mean, I just felt like just building something. So I went into creative and just built and built this. Yep, it's on one of those towers. It's a three story house and it's got a little gatehouse and the whole thing. So let's go uh, let's take a little look at what we built here. So in the plains biomes, you get these big rocks that sticks up. They work pretty damn well for being able to build a building off of. Um, so what you want to do is thread the needle here. There we go. So we've got our little gatehouse. I just want to have a, kind of an airlock, at least something to kind of make it so people can't get in here or. Oh, I hope at least we'll find out. Um, I have stairs. I'm using the 23 degree stairs or 26 degree, whatever they are. Just because they look nice and put these uh, wood beams up as railings because, man, I just didn't want to have the idea of falling off. Plus, if you're going to build something just because it looks nice, you might as well build it so it looks super good. All right. You go go up and up and up. You go up so high, you actually get into the mountain biome. And then, <laughs> knock, knock, open the door. Our first floor isn't huge but this is basically the top these four blocks right here are the top of that uh, rock pillar I did have to kind of cut the like hit the rock to kind of level it a little bit on the top but don't go crazy you can't put back rock after you break it so that's a bad thing made a little cubby storage system over here so that way you have uh, chests if wanted put the workbench down here have hearth I have a portal that leads back to my main base and do, 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 do. second floor. This is like the, the guild hall. It makes it look kind of nice. Big hearth, little bench to sit on if you feel like sitting down. Nice fire. You gotta repair your goods. You can go to the forge. Stone cutters over there. A couple fermenters, mainly because they look cool, like big kegs. Uh, one nice big table here for all of your buddies to hang out with. I did put the artisan table in there just because it worked nicely for that area. And uh, this one, I just sloped it, made it look kind of nice. Uh, hmm, probably have to fill that in. Anyway, and then we go on up here. And you get to your main bedroom area. Not only did you get to hang out here, but you can look out over your domain. It's kind of cool. I mean, you're pretty damn high up. I mean, this is really high. Uh, your dragon bed, of course, and then you could sleep the evening away with your 15 comfort, which is pretty good. Uh, I did, did use brazers up here. I didn't really worry about the smoke because the nice part about these two meter tall uh, posts is that you don't have to worry about the smoke kind of sitting in here. And I did leave uh, the walls open as much as I could to give me the shelter, uh, you know, Make it look like we had a shelter. So what did we do? I, I'm going to do a time lapse of me building this thing in a moment. But I wanted to kind of give you the heads up as what happened. And why was this thing actually kind of a pain in the butt to make? Uh, the structure system, as far as being able to get struck like support, is a real pain in the neck. Um, what you'll have to do is use a lot of iron wood beams. Mainly because it's really difficult considering how few places you actually have to tie a foundation in. Uh, if you, I wouldn't suggest using stone unless you did it all the way from the bottom, which would be ridiculous. But if you use these wood iron beams, they will act as a great foundation. So I just did a honeycomb. Well, it's not even a honeycomb. It's not even a honeycomb. It's just a freaking grid of those wood iron beams all the way out to the end. Cantilevered out for the hearth and the... Uh, storage area and then up here in order to get enough support to be able to have that third floor I did have to use these four iron beams going up to support those core wood posts um, nothing I could do about it but then again it looks kind of cool because you know it's a little awkward but you just walk over here and good to go all right so um it will probably be a while. Like, this is going to be a long video because, you know, it's a big, long time build, time lapse to build it, but it's kind of fun. Uh, let me know what you guys thought in the comments below, and I'll hopefully talk to you on the next one. See ya.